Can You Just Hold Me. It's one of those songs on the album that just leaves me completely vulnerable. Um, one thing a lot of people may not realize off the bat is that the album is very much about relationships. Your relationship with your spouse, with yourself, and um, most importantly with God. I kind of touch all um, sides of living. Um, with that being said, um, this particular song, um, I'm going to say it like this. I've been single for about three to four years. And in that time span, obviously, I shouldn't say obviously, I've, I haven't been celibate all that time. And sometimes you just want somebody to hold you, to make you feel okay, to tell you it's going to be all right. And um, sometimes we know that person, that old faithful, I think they call it, is just one phone call, a few texts away. And I'm just asking God, God, you better step in before I make that phone call, before I send this text. Because the way I'm feeling, I'm feeling vulnerable. I don't feel like being Christ-like right now. My hormones are raging, and I need you to step in right in on time. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, God, it's either them or it's you. And I'd rather be you. And one thing I've realized, and even when you hear these songs, on, there's a common thread between all of them. And between all my music, honestly. Um... It always leads back to God. No matter what you do, you cannot override God's will. I don't care if it's relationship. When God's called you to do something, you can't override it. It may seem like you're getting away for a little while. God will let you get out a little bit. You know, he'll let you go out there a little bit. And then he'll reel you back in slowly. And then you'll be right back where you started. And it's like God was trying to get me to see, son, no matter what you do, you're going to end up in the same place. Your feelings don't get hurt because that's not the person I sent for you. You understand what I'm saying? You satisfy your flesh and you're going to have to keep doing that because that's not the person I sent for you. That person belongs to somebody else. That's not yours. And I'm not to, I'm not talking about in, in reference to having sex with um, somebody's husband or somebody's wife. But I believe that God has a person that he intended you, um, intended for you to marry. You know what I'm saying? We do all this dating and then we get our heart broken and by the time we get to what God has for us, we're a complete mess. <laughs> so, um, even when I hear the song, it just, sometimes I listen to it late night. I listen to my own music because, I mean, if I don't like it, who else going to like it? But it's like, can you just hold me? Just, just hold me. Lord, I just want to be here too.